Are you seeing this? It's all over the news. What the f it's gone viral. Our pie is everywhere. Chicken head pie. Well, that's what they're serving down at Fowl. Like one of our can wonder it. Chicken head pie. Those lovely ladies from Loose Women fancy a slice of our pie. Yeah, get one on pronto, chef. So this is the basis for the pie. So what we've got in here is lots and lots of caramelized bacon. We've got lots of little gizzards, which are braised. Chicken hearts in there as well, which are a confit. So really, really slowly cooked until they're really tender. And then we've got a really rich chicken stock, which we basically roast all the carcasses. Just gonna finish it with a few fresh chives. Don't overfill it, otherwise the mix will all come out whilst the pie cooks. So this is our beautiful uh, chicken from the Ethical Butcher. And we use absolutely every part of it, oysters. And then there's also another little puck of meat that no one ever talks about here, which is just this really beautiful bit, like top of the thigh. So I take those two off, sit off and got them super, super crispy. This is like the best bit. Apparently Louis XIV only used to eat the chicken oysters. Just glazing them up with a little bit of chicken gravy. Gonna finish it with a few fresh chives. So we've got hearts in there. We've got gizzards in there. These are the chicken oysters which have just been roasted off so they're nice and crispy. A few more bits of bacon on there as well. So to prep the head, go down and then go across. Pinch across. Easy. Now pull and gently pull it back. until you get the head off. So that is our sausage casing. Inside here is the esophagus, the windpipe, and then something that we call a feed sack. So you just have to just have to peel this away and it just peels away naturally. So there you go. So you've got the, all the, the windpipe and then you've got the actual neck and that's what we want to keep intact. Okay, so take that out. That is absolutely fine in a stock. Um, it's just basically another form of chicken giblets. The neck, really beautiful sweet meat. Really, really good on its own. You can just cook these off and then chew them, like glaze them in sauce. Chew them on, all along the bone. They've got really beautiful soft meat. This is our head, which is gonna get stuffed. So this piping bag, we've got um, a, basically a chicken mousse and we just stuff that inside the bird's head. Tie it in a napkin, truss it, steam it, set it. So this head has been stuffed and steamed and then it's been left to cool. And now what all we're doing is just searing it off so the skin is nicely caramelized. And then this will be the centerpiece to our pie. So it's almost like a stargazy pie, but instead it's got a chicken head sticking out of it. What we try and do is we just try and use every part of the bird as it comes into the kitchen, really. And these are coming with the head, so we thought, why not try and get it into a dish? We're using all the rest of the birds, so let's use the head as well. Pierre Kaufman is one of the like legendary chefs from the UK. He's, I think he's the first chef to get three stars in the UK. He, he trained Marco, who then trained Gordon. So in a lot of ways, he's like the French um, sort of godfather. Kaufman's famous for his pig's trotter. We work with him on the recipe. And in France and stuff, it's not totally outrageous to use a stuffed head. And then we came up with something that we're really happy with. So we put a layer of pastry over the top of this pie. We've egg washed it. And then it just left the perfect space just to insert the head. And we've even made him a little scarf just to keep him warm. Now we're gonna cook this pie for about 25 minutes, so 180 degrees. Get me a bite. Let's get this to the lovely ladies from Loose Women.
This is a pie from a very exclusive London restaurant who they're on a mission to make sure that they don't waste any of the animal that they're cooking with. So this is the chicken pie. <laughs> what I love about this, <laughs> and I'm gonna tell you why I think it's fantastic, is it's called beak to feet eating. So it uses every part of the chicken. <laughs> Yeah, but...